Blessings, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I just want to say welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by to see what your girl have in stock for you today. In today's video, we are going to be using only two ingredients to tame that frizzy brittle and that hair that is feeling like sponge guys without further talking too much let's get right ahead and make this video i'll be setting the egg aside and cutting the portion of the aloe vera that i need for this recipe and guys aloe vera is so good for your natural hair aloe vera is not going to help you grow your hair alone but it's going to help you also treat that scalp issue remove excess oil build up on your hair so this is the portion of the aloe vera that i'm going to be using for this recipe i'm going to be cutting off the spiky end because of of course you want to be able to penetrate into your aloe vera and don't want to hurt yourself with those spiky ends <laughs> so guys i'm just going to be taking off um the skin off of the aloe vera because what we need for this recipe is the fleshy part so for me if you've been following my channel you know that i love using a grater to get the slimy part of the aloe vera because if you blend it you won't get it that slimy so i love using grater to get that slimy nature out of my aloe vera you can also blend it whichever it's okay for you but this is the metal that i love using some other persons love scooping it out or um scraping it with a knife to get the gel but this is very very simple for me and easy to get my aloe vera gel out that is why i use this method so this is the portion of the aloe vera that i'll be needing for this recipe and i've grated and here you have it so what i'm going to be doing to this i'm going to be straining this aloe vera to make sure we have it as clean as possible guys Aloe vera is not only going to help you take care of that oily scalp or grow your hair, but aloe vera will help you to strengthen and repair your hair strand. It also contains a lot of vitamins and nutrients that is also beneficial for your natural hair. It has vitamin B12, vitamin C, vitamin A, vitamin E. All of these vitamins are essential nutrients that your hair needs to grow. Yes, it also helps you to promote a healthy scalp cells like when your scalp is clean and the cells on your scalps are healthy your hair just keeps sprouting and those breakage are gone so guys what i did here i cracked in two eggs into the, my bowl because my hair is a little bit long so if your hair is not that long please use one egg but i use two eggs because my hair is a little bit long so now i have whisked the egg Egg and I added my aloe vera to it and I'm gonna be adding my aloe vera oil guys I'm gonna be adding my aloe vera oil so I, I bought I oh my god <laughs> so guys I I boil the amount of the aloe vera oil that I added to this you can as well add one teaspoon of aloe vera oil to your um, egg and uh, aloe vera mix that you already made and give it a very good stir and after stirring I'm gonna be transferring this amazing recipe into my applicator butter yes when I transfer this into my applicator bottle, it will be time to remove that frizz, to detangle our hair. Guys, here you have it. Our aloe vera and egg detangler and treatment is ready. So guys, come along with me. Let me apply this on my hair and I'm going to show you how I do that. This is my hair that has been on my hair for three weeks because of a lot of things that I was involved in, I was going through. I didn't have the time to take care of my hair and this is three weeks. My hair is all mated together. Like when I mean mated together, it's like sponge with like, literally. It was so painful here, guys. <laughs> it was so painful. Me separating my hair, oh my 
god it was painful you can even see the expression on my face when i'm trying to separate each session so i just went ahead and added this aloe vera and egg mix on my hair guys it was so easy to detangle my hair in less than 30 minutes i was done detangling the whole of my hair so i added this i used it as a pre pull and as a detangler after detangling all of my hair i covered this up with a plastic wrap and let it sit for one hour on my hair so as to enjoy all the benefits and the nutrients of the aloe vera and the egg if you don't know what egg does to your hair, egg is amazing. Egg contains biotin, very good for strengthening your hair strands and thickening your hair. So that is why it is good to apply egg on your hair. Some person says they don't like the smell of egg on the hair. Yes, guys, if you don't like the smell of your of egg on your hair, that is very, very okay. That is the reason why I always add it to other stuffs like the aloe vera and add some oils to it sometimes if you have watched some of my videos i add the onion juice and the aloe vera together though onion smells at, as well but it will help tame the smell of the egg so this is me here and i'm applying on the last section of my hair yes i'm almost done with all of this and all oh, the egg and the aloe vera mix at this point were, was all done i was just trying to um put it all the last drop on the tip of this last strand of my hair guys i want to say thank you so much for watching the video to this end if you are my old subscriber you know i love and i love you so dearly and if you are new here please don't forget to support your girl just click the subscribe button i need the notification bell on this channel i do natural hair videos natural hair treatment oils deep conditioner pre-poos shampoos and whatnot so if you are looking to take care of that natural hair with ease yes you are in the right channel stay with us and be a part of this family click the subscribe button and click the notification bell please endeavor to share this video to anyone out there that this video will benefit and also leave us a comment and give this video a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed watching at all if you enjoyed the recipe you like seeing the person you are seeing in this video <laughs> so guys give this video a huge thumbs up guys the pros of this recipe is that it is very very good for both babies babies as from six months old this recipe is good for their hair so you can use it for babies and for grown-up so that was the amount of the um shedding that i got after detangling my hair and i would just go ahead wrap this up and let this treatment sit on my hair for one hour one hour i'll go about doing every other thing that i ought to do and after one hour i'll hop in the shower and wash up my hair here you have it this is how my hair was looking like after i applied my leave-in conditioner my aloe vera leave-in conditioner if you haven't seen the video on how i make my aloe vera leave-in conditioner i'll be leaving the link to that video in the description bar below please endeavor to watch it and yeah you have it this is my hair after all uh, and i was done that mated hair came back to life everything looking juicy and beautiful guys i want to say very very big thank you to you all may god keep blessing you for me and may his unmerited favor continue to envelop your life and his grace increase in your life day by day in jesus name and in this new week may you achieve all that your heart is set to achieve more than you can ever think of or imagine and may you be far from wicked and unreasonable men May, may evil be far from you in this week in the name of jesus amen so beautiful people thank you once again for staying to the end of the video and don't forget that your girl love you so dearly and thank you for supporting this channel thank you for staying with me to all my subscribers you are amazing if you just watched this video you as well you are amazing 
so this is how i brought this brittle and melted hair to become juicy lovely soft and well moisturized with aloe vera my leave-in conditioner was made with aloe vera and my pre poo and as well i used it as a deep conditioner on my hair and as a detangler was also made with aloe vera added with egg so beautiful people this is my hair and i'm ready for the week i'm just going to put it in a bun and i will be good to go yeah i love you so so dearly god bless you and i will see you in my next one bye for now mwah, mwah, mwah.